Hey guys, Tuesday morning here. I'm Lena and I am happy to be with you. Uh, my last name is hard to say. It's Abu Jamra and uh, I have written books and have a ministry called Living with Power that I'd love you to check out. But here on YouTube, I share these devotionals that I've written uh, called Power Minutes because it takes about a minute to read. And uh, I hope they bless you. They're meant to be biblical truth for everyday life, just ways to connect with God through his word. And the verse I'm going to focus on today is from Galatians 6, 3. It says, for if anyone thinks he's something when he is nothing, he deceives himself. Hey, the Bible is not always as hard to understand as we make it to be. God speaks clearly and directly about what matters. As an example, for if anyone thinks he is something when he is nothing, he deceives himself. There seems to be two extremes of people, those who think too highly of themselves and those who think too poorly of themselves. In Galatians 6, 3, Paul is pointing to the proud who have an inflated sense of self, although it's equally deceptive to have a deflated sense of self. Your true self is a place where you acknowledge your strength and your weaknesses and admit that you need help in certain areas. Your true self shines when you stop living like you have anything to lose. Your authentic self doesn't try to impress others and doesn't hide in shame. Your true, self, your true self is most authentic when you live in private as you do in public. What aspect of yourself are you presenting to people? Are you reflecting the best image of yourself to others, hoping to gain their approval? Or are you living your true self where freedom reigns? Okay? Okay. Uh, people want us to be our true self. And honestly, sometimes I feel bad that, you know, I'm, I'm working, I, I do telehealth, so I'm, I've been working all morning, and so I don't have enough time anymore in the day to shower every day, put on all my makeup, do all the things that people do to get on this. And so this is my authentic self. And I used to feel a little bit bad about it, and now it is what it is. Like, I'm not trying to impress you guys. I, I pray that God's word will move you. But the idea isn't even about the looks. It's about just being who you are with people. And if you're your true self, you don't have to worry about bad days and good days. You're just, you're just who you are. And if they love you, that's great. And if they don't, that's their loss. And so I'm happy you're here. I'm happy to know you. If you'd like us to know you better, tell us a little bit about yourself in the comment section and, or email me. And I'd love to be praying for you more specifically. In the meantime, check out livingwithpower.org slash power minute for a written transcription of these uh, devotionals. All right. See you tomorrow.